How's it going, YouTube? I'm Mitch Santona. Welcome to my Disney channel. Today, we're taking a look at Disney's Planes Pit Row Gift Packs. Okay, so this is the first series of the three available gift sets, the gift packs, they're called. I got a couple. I got two of them at Toys R Us and one at Target. So they're found at different stores. But the first one is Dusty Crop Hopper here, and he comes with Dottie. That's the name of his little... Hilo companion thing. He comes with a little tent and it looks like a little flag. And here are the other ones you can buy. And I've got the other two. We've got Bulldog and El Chupacabra. And if you want to read a little bit about Dusty, there you go. This is Bulldog. Now these are all die cast, by the way, too. It does say it on the box. It doesn't look like that one was. It, it just does it looks so glossy that it almost looks looks like a plastic, but that's just really nice paint. So here's Bulldog. If you want to read his bio, he comes with his little pity. That's what they're called. A pity. And here is El Chupacabra. I love, I love El Chupacabra. He's just huge <laughs> compared to all the other ones I have. And he's got a little pit. He's got El Chupacabra's pity. That's his name too. So uh, he doesn't really have, he's unnamed as of yet. But if you want to read a little bit about his bio, there you go. Let's get these all out and see what they look like all displayed. All right, everybody's depackaged. I'm loving the little metal hilos. These, these guys are really cool. They're actually a little bit heavy too. They roll really well. And they definitely fit into that Cars universe. I'm a big fan of Cars and Cars 2. Uh, so these guys are awesome. All these little planes are awesome too. We'll look at those individually now. These flags come, uh, you can kind of keep them there if you want. That's how they came wrapped. Uh, but there is a spot to plug it in too. So you can kind of fly their, you know, their respective numbers here. Like Bulldog's number 11. We got Chupacabra's number 5. And we got Dusty, who is lucky number 7. Let's see if I can get that off. Oh, yeah, man. Look at this. Absolutely beautiful. Looks like some sort of a little hanger of some sort over here. All right, so here is Bulldog's Pity. And uh, it's his pit bull, I guess. <laughs> he is the British Bulldog. And I love that because I used to love the British Bulldog. If anyone knows that reference. Got a little uh, Great Britain flag there. He's number 11. Got the little Cars guy's eyes. And these little forks are definitely not dangerous. So if you're thinking that, you know, a little one could stab themselves, it would be very hard to do that because they're just mush. All right, here is the British Bulldog. And we've got a nice, beautiful looking Great Britain flag there across the, the nose here. He's got his little mouth is down here. It looks like a World War II craft of some sort. Double propeller craft. Here we go. They both spin. The wheels spin. And he definitely fits in with this whole universe of cars and planes. Says Bulldog on the side, number 11. Beautiful paint, rolls real nice. Let's look at his buddies. Here's the pity for El Chupacabra. I love El Chupacabra. <laughs> I don't know what role he's gonna play in the movie, but just so far, all the toys that I have of him, uh, he's probably my favorite one. He's big and he's hefty. He's got the real fat nose there on him. He's got a like a luchador cape on. I really like that. And his little pity's cool too, because he's got the little lucha libre mask going on and here is el chupacabra very much decoed up in the mexican flag i love the little mask i love his cape his cape is a little rubbery thing uh, and i don't believe it will come off you could probably tear it off uh, but i'm not going to do that because he looks cool with it on right check him out now this is dotty so i imagine this this character here is probably going to get fleshed out if it's you know part of dusty's crew and she, I believe Dottie is a she, I'm going to call her a she right now, uh, has a little tool belt with some little, I don't know, little tools, little implements in there. And this is all rubbery plastic, so it's not real, you know, again, nothing dangerous on these little things. But it's a heavy little figure because all of the body of it is die cast. And here is Dusty. Dusty is obviously the main character of the story. It's Dane Cook's voice. Uh, he's going to be kind of fun, fun character here. I heard that he's afraid of heights, but he's like one of the fastest planes around. So there's some interesting character stuff going on with Dusty. Uh, but this plane, just I've opened a few of the other die-cast ones already, and I've got reviews on them. If you want to go check those out, please do. I would appreciate it. Uh, there's not a lot of whole difference here. There's just a couple different little uh, places that the blue paint is at, and the number's a little bit different. But other than that, we've seen this guy before. But now he comes with Dottie in the tent, so kind of a bonus. You almost want to buy this one. Thank you very much, people. This has been Mitch Santona. You have just seen the first wave of the die-cast gift sets. These are three different sets. 
I think they're around 12 bucks, 11.99 or something at Target or Toys R Us. So if you guys are looking for these, I know these three are out right now, and I think we're gonna get some more with the like with their little tents and their little high low dudes. So hopefully that'll be coming soon because I want to get the whole collection like this and have a big row of tents because that would look just awesome. I'll see you guys later. Stay tuned for some more Disney fun.